first part of a METAR is the station identifier. This is a four letter code as established by the International Civil Aviation Organization. Next is the date and time of the report. This is depicted in a six digit group. The first two digits are the date. The last four digits are the time of the METAR. The modifier denotes that the METAR came from an automated source or that the report was corrected. Wind is reported with five digits. The first three digits indicate the direction the true wind is blowing in tens of degrees. The last two digits indicate the speed of the wind in knots. Prevailing visibility is typically reported in statute miles. Weather can be broken down into two different categories, qualifiers and weather phenomena. It often makes sense to work backwards when you are decoding METARs, starting with the weather phenomena and then determining the qualifiers.